But first, a serious crash investigation is underway right now in Coleraine Township. Look at that scene. The person behind the wheel of a stolen car slams into another driver, and that accident is now being called a deadly one. And good evening, everybody. I'm Mike Dardis. And I'm Cherie Palello. An innocent driver has been killed in all of this. It happened at Coleraine Avenue there in Mall Road, just south of the Northgate Mall. WLWT News host Curtis Fuller has been on the scene for us all day. He joins us live now with more. Hi, Curtis. Mike and Cherie, I tell you, a very sad situation when you consider the circumstances of this accident. Let me just step out of the scene so you can see, as you mentioned, a very active scene still here at Mall and Coleraine. The road has been closed for seven hours and could be shut down much longer since this has now become a death investigation. Life taken away in a moment by a fleeing suspect. It's terrible, and it's probably another one of these little teenage punks that stole a car. That's what one woman had to say about the horrific accident that shut down part of Coleraine Avenue. People are crazy. I'm serious. Why don't you just get a job and earn a living like everybody else instead of stealing and everything else? Police tell us a person driving a stolen red Mercedes was speeding, driving north on Coleraine Avenue about 10 o'clock this morning. One of our officers saw him and uh, was just beginning to go after him when this, this intersection happened and there was a pretty major hit. He ran into another car that was turning and uh, it's a pretty significant impact. A white vehicle driven by 25 year old Ronald Washington was coming out of Mall Road and was blindsided when that red car slammed right into it. A passenger in a white car is still in the hospital, the condition unknown. The suspect actually tried to run from the scene but was arrested by police. Get a life, people. I mean, I worked three jobs to support my family. Get a freaking life. The frustration from this person who was on the scene just as a witness, uh, and you heard a lot of similar frustration when they, when people on the scene just heard the circumstances behind this of a, a stolen vehicle um, and uh, innocent people involved in this accident just going about their day, 25 years old, unbelievable. Officially on the record, police have not released the status of the passenger in Washington's car. I can tell you that that person uh, did have surgery, but no uh, uh, status report at this point. The suspect also taken to the hospital, no word on his condition, but an officer just came up to me as we were getting ready to go on air and told me he is being booked now into the Hamilton County Jail, and we will get you more information on that. And of course, as you can imagine, uh, that individual uh, facing many, many charges now as a result of this uh, fatal accident. Reporting live, I'm Curtis Fuller, WLWT News 5.